If you'd like to add game audio using your Elgato Wave 3 microphone, here's exactly how you do it. All right, first things first, make sure you have the Wavelink software up and running. You probably have your mic as an input there. This is the free software that comes with the mic. And the next step is you're gonna go to an open channel on the digital mixer here. Hit the plus button and go straight down to game. Then once you add game as a source, I like to add it. I like to call it the name of the game that I'm playing. Uh, helps my brain, but you guys can choose whatever you want here. I'm going to do Cyberpunk 2077 for this demo. You can do whatever you'd like there. Then once you have that added as a source in your Wavelink software, you're ready to bring the input in. Now there's a couple more steps. So the first step is that you're going to make sure the game is open. <laughs> so I've got a uh, version of Cyberpunk 2077 open on my computer on my other monitor. And so that's going to allow me uh, to uh, basically bring in my audio here into the mix. Got it? And as you can see, that input is recognized by my computer right here in this menu. How do you get into this menu? You need to get there to route your audio accordingly. So what we're going to do is we're going to move into the search bar down here at the bottom of your computer. You're going to type sound and you're going to see the menu called sound mixer options. That menu is going to pull up the routing menu that we have over here. Click sound mixer options and then boom, you're going to see all the inputs that are on your computer. Open the game first, then the game will show up here as an option. Got it? Cool. Next step is you're going to select as your input Wavelink game since that's what we set up in Wavelink. Then for your output, select Wavelink Stream. Cool. That will make it so that your game audio doesn't go to a random place like your speakers, your headphones, your monitor, your capture card, or whatever. You move it exactly where you want it to go, right here into the Wavelink software without letting it go all nilly-willy into some random location. Understood? Do those two steps so you don't get crazy feedback loops with your game audio. Awesome. So now that we have routed appropriately, I'm gonna turn on the, the volume in my Cyberpunk 2077, and boom, there it is. It's showing up right here in the mixer. See how the levels are popping right here on this channel? Awesome. And as you can see, I have muted it in my monitor mix so it doesn't blow your headphones up for the recording, but I'm letting it go through my stream mix. And so by doing that, as you can see with the volume levels down here, it's not in the monitor mix, as you can see, and it is popping down here in the stream mix. So you can decide by adjusting the volume levels on this channel how much you want to hear it in your headphones by adjusting the headphones side of things in the mixer or how much you want it to be in the stream mix by adjusting that mix here independent of all of your other uh, volume levels in this digital mixer giving you basically unparalleled mixing power with really really easy interface for you to decide do you want to hear the game audio in your headphones if you do what volume level do you want it to be and how loud should it be in the stream mix you decide you do the slider on that audio and you pick what that volume level is gonna be for your audience. Awesome to be able to control both of those side by side using this method. Make sure you follow all of these steps exactly as I stated them, or your audio is gonna be jacked and you'll have double feedback loops. Add it in the channel, open the game, route it accordingly, and then play back the audio to test it and make sure that it's popping here in the bars, and boom, you're ready to rock. Your game audio is coming through either your monitor mix or your stream mix or both. You get to pick. The power's in your hands with the Elgato Wave 3 mic. Enjoy that game audio mix. Hope you win lots of games. Have fun, game streamers and game content creators.